Welcome everyone, we are the Grin Brothers and we're continuing our playthrough of Ooh, Friends to the End. Let's go to Sky. Oh, um, oh yeah. You could have just used Bolo. Well, there's a laser beam here. But yeah, you use Rocky Tops. Okay. So they give two options to get away or get around that those blocks and then it's just like You see when you speak it right out? Yeah, basically. Mm. Um So let's see, something we can both talk about though for a conversation topic for uh, this episode. Yeah. That's weird. Still weird. Um a trailer came out recently. Oh my god, health. For something that still seems so surreal, they... Kill them with Sky. They actually exist. Oh, yeah, that did happen. Detective Pikachu movie got a trailer recently. Yeah. It's a thing. I'm it exists. Scared, Mr. Real Mime. Realistic Pokemon are a thing now. They're very realistic. Right. Wow, this area seems very rocky focused. It does seem to be. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna... Is anyone in need of money? No. I want magic. It's just getting magic right. I'm glad we got magic. Here you go, you can do this section. Okay. It'll probably be Bola. But Scar will be helpful as well. Um... Yeah, Detective Pikachu of Ryan Reynolds as Pikachu. It doesn't seem to be following the plot of the game. No. Because the Pikachu can only be heard by one person. I don't know if that might have been part of the plot of the game as well, but... Never Who knows? Really, never really looked... That involves someone playing Detective Pikachu, and I think you experience Detective Pikachu. I never played the demo or anything. I had a demo up, I never tried it. I was... like The thing is, I was wanted Detective Pikachu, but... It kind of took too long to come out sort of thing, and I've kind of moved on from with other yeah. games I wanted to play instead. Um, like, I was interested in it back in, like, uh, 2012, well, 2013, when they kind of were first talking about it. Oh, uh, you just... Good job. No. Right. You're right, this is very rotty focused. Okay, I need Sky first. But then I can rotty up. Well, I mean, to be fair, you could probably manage it with Sky. No. No. Nah. Because they really like being very teasy with the uh, platforming difference. It always feels like you can just about reach it, but you can't. Yeah. Give me magic. We got a squid. We did get a squid. That does not let us heal. No, it does not. Um, no, but yeah, Detective Pikachu um, doesn't seem to be following the plot of the... They acknowledge you can somehow fail at being a Pokemon trainer. Yeah, which is really interesting to sort of see. Um, Remember, got, other jobs exist. Yeah. Um, they seem to be referencing that maybe the area takes place in the Sinner region, but then making the Sinner region very American. Well, I say American, but it's got like a Japanese Chinatown-esque section to it. Is it supposed to be Sinner? Well, they got, well, the Pokemon League said City No Championship. Ah, did it? Yeah. Maybe it's just Sinnoh's had cross-cultural Johto, so maybe this is set after games. Or maybe they're just uh, teasing Gen 4. Maybe. For Let's Go. <laughs> Please don't. Let's Go Sinnoh. No. Let's not. Let's not go. <laughs> you know what's going to happen, Liam. You can't escape your fate. 
Barry's gonna wait till you heal before he fights you. If you are not on full health, he'll heal your Pokemon for no. you. No. <laughs> Bye, heck. <laughs> Guess you just weren't a fan of that one. Apparently not. Good thing he just stood there. Yeah, stood there and okay. let you kill him. I didn't like life anyway. I'm not getting paid enough for this. Gosh, there's a satisfying thud to Bolo's attack. Yes. Makes you wonder. Yeah, hear that. Yeah, I, I've played as him. Have you? Oh. oh! You still managed to screw it up somehow. Wait, wait, was there two? You, yeah. Wow, I didn't think there was that many. I thought the other one was just a jewel. No. Like that? Yeah. To be fair, there are green jewels, so... There are, yes, and of a similar shape. How dare you. Well, I, I mean, I, I've played as Sky, so... Green oh, jewel. yeah, sorry. That slipped my mind entirely. I just figured it made sense to do that, instead of, you know... Disgusting. You know, I thought, you were, I, thought you were my... being, I thought you were being disgusted by the fact that I did the sensible thing of going close and whacking him instead of constantly trying to slam him, snipe him from a distance. You've like you stolen did. my bolo time. You've stolen my rotty time. You're just scum, really. You literally have the power to make a platform. Mm. It's not a very good power, but yes. I mean, it's more effective than your glide. That is true. <laughs> As noted. No offense. Uh, yeah, no offense to you, Sky, but you kind of got the. You kind of feel like the weakest link here. As you can see here. Uh, right. I'm gonna have to. Oh, yeah. Bolo's just way too good for a lot of this. They really made sure he was versatile. I mean, to be fair, if they removed all the rings which have suddenly been added across the stages. Is, is this really how we're going to do it? Or to be fair, at least Roy Tops has an upwards attack on like Shantae. There you go, he's dead. I figured I'd do that for you. It's not really, like, if you mess it up, you just appear next to them and take damage. But, it kind of works. Oh, see what I mean about the tease? Couldn't even make that little platform. Yeah, oh, it's because... Ashante, you've got powers that mean you don't really need to. That was a good jump. I need a jump immediately, but... He is dead. Dunk. His oh, it's half heart, even though it's one full heart, but... Doesn't matter. We're about to go into the Armour Baron fight. So we are. I trust you to do this. I've seen how efficient your Armour Baron fights have gone in the past. So why are you trusting me? Because it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um... Yeah, yeah, I haven't... Much about the I yeah, have the, the, trailer, the trailer looks really good. Oh, yeah, like, it's, it's strange, like we're hearing all this news about how disastrous the Monster Hunter looks to be our kids are going. Oh, yeah. But then Detective Pikachu somehow makes it... Work? Yeah, like it's Which is a surprising scarily thing. realistic, but people have always, But it's not like So here's the reason I like it. Normally when people do top ten realistic looking Pokemon things, right. They make them too animalistic. Other than the fact that they just, you know, steal the images from Demon Art or whatever. Mm -hmm. And then don't credit the artists. It's not realistic. It's scary. Yeah. They intentionally make them look scary and intimidating, like monsters. But it's not... I mean, they're called pocket monsters, yeah, but it's not what they are. They're, they're animals. Yeah. They would look like animals, not terrifying creatures from the depths of hell. Except Mr. Mime, but he's a terrifying creature from the depths of hell <laughs> yeah. in the games as well. Yeah. Oh man, I can't wait to see their attempt to do a realistic CGI depiction of Jinx. Oof, yeah, that's going to be... That reminds me of a Halloween co uh, comic I saw, which was like, uh, you got this uh, uh, boy uh, go, 
Oh, uh, Daddy, this year I want to go, uh, go to Halloween trick or treating as a Pokemon. You got the uh, uh, you got this uh, man with like a uh, smoking pipe. He goes, "Anything you want, my boy." Oh, uh, kid appears in like a Jinx costume. You got the man goes, "Was burn your Bible, boy? There is no God." <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah, like they look good. Mm. It's weird Jigglypuff being furry, but I guess it kind of makes sense with the puff part. But I okay. always expected Jigglypuff to be more like a dolphin. Yeah. I uh, think I think they've tried to put fur on too many Pokemon. I mean I mean it, it makes sense. I mean the one one like some of them Jigglypuff did a does have make, a tuft of fur yeah, on its head. A lot of them make a lot of sense. Jigglypuff looks a bit odd like that. Psyduck looks really odd with feathers. Psyduck looks terrifying. Like but Psyduck I've always imagined very smooth because but it, is, it is a bird. But ducks like when they've been in the water they always kinda of look smooth because their feathers are kind of pat, matted down as it were from the water. Yeah, but they still have feathers. So yeah, no, but it never. Golduck will look terrifying, though. A feathery Golduck. And Mr. Mime is 100% accurate, yeah. which is incredible. I want Charizard to see looks Hi really cool. Charizard does. I want to see Hypno. Did you see the Emolgas? No. There, there were Emolgas on top of the. In the in that little street scene, there were Emolgas atop the uh, roof. Oh. And they look adorable. The fur really goes well with them. Some of the Pokemon are perfectly suited for the realistic look. I want to see Hypno, because he's got a really fluffy neck. And Pikachu looks really good. Pikachu does. And I like how they managed to include the original Pikachu voice actress's uh, voice. Uh, whenever they, uh, whenever, whenever I try to talk to them, they'll just hear Pika Pika. Uh, uh. Hey, uh, can you understand what this guy's saying? Pika Pika. Uh, ah, Pika Pika. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cute. Uh, they've also managed to keep in the whole Detective Pikachu has a fondness with women sort of thing. Yeah. Uh, not as gruff, or as you know. You know, coffee swelling as he is, but you know they're they're not following the game, the spin-off game, too closely. It's very much just the concept of it rather than the. Also, plot. from what I can guess from the plot, someone's actually dead. Well, captured, I believe, because you know your father, know. your it father's looked, missing. It looked like he had a car on top of him in one. Yeah, scene. but they only, but they said his father's missing, so they don't know if he's dead or alive. I'm no expert, but laying on the floor of a car on top of you is not usually a sign of being alive. <laughs> That ship cost billions of crowdfunded dollars! It's true. Whoa! Hello, ladies! Hey, what about me? He is best waifu, after all. And my baron just knows he's well out of his league. Whoa, sorry fella, didn't hardly see you there. Look, on account of only having one eye, it's really hard to notice people. We're at max capacity, kid, so how about you step aside and make room for a real man? Oh no, he's challenging Bolo to a fight. Eyes on the prize, ladies! Eye on the prize. Oh. Just one. no one can resist a man in uniform. Boom! So I'm gonna wear carpets. <laughs> yeah. So who's gonna be the lucky lass? I got a flying carpet uniform and about a dozen animated movie soundtracks to choose from. <laughs> the last one is tempting. Ammo Brand's gonna show you the world. We're gonna soar over an undercloud, fly low, and drag our fingers in the lake. All that garbage. Step right on up. Plenty of ammo baron to go round. No tickers? Anyone? Pass. I'm in. Oh, seriously? <laughs> what? You'd skip out on a heartfelt musical number of yours truly? Can we just have like them make a heartfelt musical number with ammo baron? <laughs> I don't... Fine! In that case, witness the fury! Of an arrow baron scorned! It would have been funny if Bilo said yes. Shiny shimmering soldier. Oh, well, see? CHP alliteration! Always the best! This, mm. Puns are nothing. This alliteration is. is this godsend. is going to be a very slow fight, isn't it? I don't know why you were collecting the money, you maxed out. Ah, he's down. You have magic as well. Although, your magic's not strong enough to be able to kill them. In fact, you are not strong enough to be able to kill them. That's more effective. Oof, that's satisfying, isn't it? Yeah, oh yeah. Compared to the last time, oh. you have to... Suffer using the ninja. Oh, 
He's not coming down. Why don't you just keep using the magic? Oh, he's down. Uh, I wasn't hitting him very well like that. Yeah, but you I was expecting him to come down eventually. You're evil. A true sinner. I hit the ground like twice. <laughs> <laughs> you declare me a friend of her, but you're a character or a character. Completely. That's not as bad as being a friend to her. Also, mine was my mistake. You also it's because you don't seem to understand the world. And French is not a sin. Because it's not a thing. Run up to him. Kill him with the birds. It's a very slow process. So it is. <laughs> My god, Sky is so weak, isn't she? <laughs> oh yeah, she is. Well, it's very satisfying to kill a lot of people in one go. Come on, yeah, there we, go. we go. The birds, the birds have their day. Eventually. Ammo Baron got bird demic. Shocked and terrored. Mm. They made a sequel to that movie. I heard it wasn't as good. No. It ah. wasn't. Mm. Uh, what happened? Birds. Birds happened. Yeah, um yeah, the text picture is looking uh pretty cool. Yeah. Um it's it's interesting how dark the palette is though. Well it makes sense. Yeah, I mean so, yeah, it's a noir story, but Alright, so where to now? When Rotty left to watch the end of the world show, I stayed behind. You're lucky I was left behind because of her. You should have told us what Hypno Baron was planning from the beginning. I had to walk all the way to his castle on foot. I was promised new legs and now I'm going to take them. Try it. Come on, you two. Hands to yourselves. Hypno Baron's castle should be the final memory. Can we do this one more time? Oh yeah, because you know the obviously... other one hasn't happened yet. Yeah. Which means our final boss will be. So I'm kind of curious as to what they're going to do with the Negashane fight. Well, well, I'm be... assuming it's Negashane with fight. Yeah. I suppose. That's the spirit. <laughs> Transform. <laughs> Form of eagle! Form of tiger! <laughs> but yeah, form um, of gorilla! Since <laughs> listing a friend and Mega Sword. Yeah, it's, I, I really like how there's more than just Gen 1 Pokemon in the Detective Pikachu. Yeah. Like, I was worried that was what they were going to do. Just Gen 1 Pokemon. I don't know why they chose Mr. Mime of all things to advertise their thing. Again, because of the joke, you know, the expressions and not talking. Yeah, I know, but like, why, of every Pokemon you could choose, would you look at Mr. Mime? <laughs> a hyper-realistic Mr. Mime. That's like a balding 30-year-old man pretending to be a mime. With dodgeballs for his shoulder pads. <laughs> and when... That is what I want to use to help promote this movie. Pikachu, the adorable fluffy creature. Jigglypuff, who is now an adorable fluffy creature. Psyduck, who is just... Psyduck, who is terrifying beyond all belief. And Mr. Mime! Who is terrifying even in his own game! Mr. Mime. I mean, it could be worse. You could have chosen Hypno, mm. which would be worse. You could have chosen Malamar. I do not want to see a hyper realistic Malamar. Mm. Yeah, but, but again, they really have definitely just taken the concept and not really relied on much else. I mean, Tim, uh, Tim Goodman doesn't even have his jacket. Hey, kid! I'm a fairy! Let me in! Like, you know, like you wouldn't be, and you know, aside from the name, he has like no connection, and the missing father, he doesn't seem to have any connection to Tim Goodman. Yeah. I, think. I mean, Tim Goodman, like, I don't mind that, you know, he looks different, but I think they should have at least tried to dress similar. I mean, just a red, having red clothing would have uh, at least tied it in better. Yeah. But um. They probably literally just heard the concept of the game one. That'd be a funny movie. Mm. Um. But yeah, yeah. Um, it's surprising a lot of people. People do seem to be in two ways. They're either Jesus 
Christ, this is terrifying. Or, wow, this is a lot better than I was expecting. I'm really psyched for it. It's a lot better and than I was no in expecting, between. Yeah. but it's still terrifying. I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. But then again, it might also help the last movie piece I saw was a tank in Monster Hunter. So. Yeah. The newest monster! What gear can I get from it? The AK-47! <laughs> awesome. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Um, yeah, so... Uh, Let's end the episode here. Cheerio!